majority of you think that the only way to get hired on people per hour is by looking for jobs and sending in proposals. Well, that is not true. Today, I'm going to share with you a method on how you can get hired even without sending a single proposal. But this doesn't mean that you should stop sending in job proposals. Continue bidding for jobs, but this method will actually help you get more clients. Well, today is your lucky day. You learn how to create and post an offer and how to set the right price so as to get hired. My name is Vince and this is Actionable User where we help you become more actionable when using people per hour. Without wasting much of your time, we'll jump right into this video and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. So right now I'm in people per hour and I want to post an offer. So to do that, as I can see here at the top, there is this orange button, written post offer. So I'm going to click on it. Here I'm taken to a place where I'm allowed to post an offer in seconds. And before we begin, we need to see that here there are some blank spaces whereby we need to fill some information like category and all this. And here there are some freelancer tips. These are somehow the guidelines or rules of posting this offer. So the first one is be original. So you need to create an offer which is different from what everyone else is creating. The second one is that you need to be as specific as you can about the service that you are offering. Make sure that the hirer can immediately see your offer and know exactly what service you are offering and exactly what you want to communicate. So thirdly, you need to set a realistic delivery time frame. Yeah, so this is here to prevent a person from communicating one delivery date then not being able to meet it. So you need to make clear how much time you need. The other one is make your offer stand out. Now you need to make your offer stand out by using quality images or even video illustrating the service you are offering. So you are allowed to use images and videos to showcase the talents and skills that you are able to do here on people per hour. Also, you need to make sure that the offer meets the posting policies. Before you create any offer, make sure that you meet, you click on these posting policies and here are the policies. So you need to go through or read all these and know that there are some prohibited services, there are some do's, there are some don'ts, so as to prevent your offer from being rejected or any other thing. So make an effort to go through all of this. These are the guidelines. So now let's begin by creating the offer. And we need to know that uh, the offer is a, should be a service and that service uh, should be delivered for a fixed price in a set time frame. So let's do that. Now here there is I can. Now you can go ahead and write a sentence describing what you are going to do. I'm going to write, I can proofread and edit your documents. Yeah, here, I'll go ahead and enter the price that I'm charging for this service of proofreading and en editing documents. So here, let me put something like $20. Yeah, you've seen that it has gone ahead and filled these other ones. We can see here that there is an example of, I can design your business card for 60 euros. Now you can use this as a, an example. You can choose to customize prices here or not. As we move down, we can see a place written when will you deliver the offer. Now it is already filled in in one day, but you can go ahead and edit this and put in the number of days. So I'll go ahead and click on two days. As we move down, you can see the category and the subcategory here. So if we click on here, so I'll select writing and translation, then I'll come here and select content writing. Next, I need to add tags, a maximum of five. As I write, you can see that over here it is searching and it is going to give me some options over here. Yeah, then we have a couple of editing here. So I'm going to click on copy editing. Then I'll come here next and write proofreading. Yeah, here's the best match. I'll click on it. So I've reached the maximum of five. Now I want to go ahead and include other things like photos and videos to make it fun. 
Okay, so to get photos to use, I'm going to go to this website which is Pexels. You can get it at pexels.com. I'm going to come here to the search engine and I'll search for anything that I want. So download them to your computer. Then we can now come here and drop them here. Yeah, so I have a photo here. I'm going to drag it and drop it. And I can see that my photo is being uploaded. It is 100% complete. So this will be the thumbnail for this offer. So let's move ahead. I need to provide more details about my offer. Now, explain in more detail what exactly you will deliver to the buyer. Now I'll go ahead and write here. But ahead of time, I had come up with the description for this place. So I'm going to Microsoft Word and I'll show you exactly what I've done so that you can come and paste it here. Okay, so I've written need error free articles, want no mistakes and zero errors on your documents before publishing, want quick work done at affordable fees, I'm here to meet all your wishes. So I'm telling him that he's going to get error free articles, no mistakes on his documents before publishing and quality work and also that I guarantee him affordable fees and here I'm telling him that I can meet all other related wishes if he wants. So I'll go ahead and copy this. Yes, I'll paste it here. So I'm going to go ahead and provide a description for my offer. So that description should be optimized for search results. So I've gone ahead and written some descriptions here. Like, first of all, I'm going to do grammar and spell check using tools like Grammarly. Then I'm going to guarantee him proper punctuation and also the person is going to get document formatting like inserting tables, diagrams and other things. And lastly, this person is going to get me to organize and label content within their document. Here there is a slot which allows me to earn extra money by offering optional add-on services to the buyer. Now I can add services like research and writing for an extra $20 and here I can set the number of days so I'll go ahead and set it to two days then I have an option of adding more items like similar to this so I'm going to click here so I can insert citations and references so I'll set the price at $10 and I can deliver the work in one day now as we move on there's a slot here which allows us to deliver the work quicker and get more money. I need to insert the price here. For an extra $10, I'm going to de deliver the work in one day. Now, earlier on, I had stated that I'm going to do the work in two days and for $20. But here, for an extra $10, they can get the work in one day. So I'm going to move on. Here, I'm being told that I need to state what I need from the buyer to get started. Now, I need to explain what I need from the buyer to deliver the work. Now to do this type of work, I'll need some things like clear instructions and all the essential material. So I'm done with that part. Then there's a area here asking, how are you planning to work with the buyer? Now you have an option of working remotely or working on site. Before we can post the offer, we see here that there is a check box asking us to read all this and be sure to understand the terms and conditions. Make sure you read all this, then you can click on this and you can post your offer. Yeah, I can see that my offer has been created. I'm being given an opportunity to boost my offer for seven days by paying this $23. So you need to understand that this is optional. So you can go ahead and feature it or skip. And here, I'm being allowed to share my offer to boost the sales. So you can share it on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter or you can just copy this link and share it with anybody on any website. You need to know you, that if someone decides to hire you, you'll get some alerts over here. And if you want to check out other people's offers, you can just come here to this area under the specific category that you are doing like writing and translation whereby I can look for proofreading and I can see other people's offers regarding proofreading like here you can see 
the way other people are making their offers you can see here is the photo and the description over here you can see other ones and all these other ones so you can get ideas for creating your offer from this place over here wow creating offers on people per hour is as easy as that did you know that there are jobs that you can get hired on people per hour even without having any skill or experience click on the video in the description to learn more about that if you have a question or if you think that i missed something tell me in the comment section below like this video share it with your friends subscribe to this channel and guys i'll see you on the next video enjoy